Hello again, ladies and gentlemen, I'm Joe Handy, the Android Authority App Guy, and in this quick video, we're gonna take a look at the best Android root apps. First up is Flashify. This simple application lets you do a range of things such as download and install various recoveries, schedule ROMs and other zips to be flashed, and a whole lot more. It's a great tool for root users. Full Screen is an application that removes the soft keys and replaces them with something else. You can choose from a pie menu to corner buttons and a whole lot more. It's a fun alternative to the standard soft keys. GMD Auto Hide Soft Keys is another application that will hide your soft keys from sight if you don't want them to be seen. The mechanics are slightly different, but the idea is pretty much the same and it's another option for those who want to hide their soft keys. Goo Manager is the mobile application for the Goo.im website. There you can find all sorts of stuff like recoveries to download and install, ROMs, gaps, and a whole lot more. It's had its ups and downs, but it's generally pretty solid. Greenify is an application that analyzes what apps run, when, and how frequently. You can shut down those applications so they don't eat up your precious battery life. It's considered a must-have for root users, and we agree. Quick Boot is both an application that is absurdly simple but insanely useful. It allows you to boot directly into recovery, bootloader mode, or download mode. It's a must-have for pretty much all root users. ROM Toolbox is a sort of all-in-one option that allows the install of recoveries, managing applications, and there's even a built-in root-enabled file browser. Just be careful when using it because some options are for advanced users only, and it can mess things up a little bit. Root Explorer is a root-enabled file browser. It's a solid option with a good set of features, and you can even use it to change file permissions. The interface is simple to use, even if it's a bit old school. SD Fix is a ridiculously simple application that tries to fix the lockdown SD card issue found on KitKat and Lollipop devices. I've personally tried it on four devices and it's worked every single time for me. It won't work on all devices, but you should still give it a shot. Super SU is the de facto super user application available on Android and chances are you have it already. It's developed by Chainfire who is a well-known icon in the root and mod scene. If you don't have it, you should definitely get it. Tasker is a very powerful application that gives you the power to do pretty much whatever you want to do with your device. It has a steep learning curve, but the possibilities are virtually limitless. All tinkers should definitely Definitely try it out. Titanium Backup is quite possibly the most recommended root application of all time and for good reason. With it you can uninstall bloatware, freeze applications so they can't run, and perform backups on your apps and app data. It's a must have and you should already have it. Exposed Framework is likely the number one reason people still root their devices these days. Exposed is a framework that other developers can use to create modules that do literally all kinds of things. For many it has replaced flashing ROMs and it's an integral part of the root experience now. And that about does it for this video folks. The video likely won't be updated again, but the article definitely will be, so stop by from time to time to see what's new. Also, if you have any recommendations, leave them in the comments below because I'm always looking for more awesome applications. If you haven't already, don't forget to follow and subscribe to Android Authority. As always, thanks for watching everybody, and have a wonderful day.